हे गाइस वेलकम टू द चैनल हेल्थ ट्रिक्स एंड टिप्स इन इंग्लिश द बेस्ट प्रेगनेंसी सेंट्रिक चैनल अम्बिकल कॉर्ड दैट इज द सोर्स ऑफ विटामिन मिनरल्स न्यूट्रिएंट्स ऑक्सीजन टू द बेबी इनसाइड द वोम व्हाट विल हैपन इफ दिस अम्बिकल कॉर्ड एंटेंगल्स टू द बेबीज नेक विल द बेबी इनसाइड द वोम फाइंड इट डिफिकल्ट टू ब्रीद विल द हार्ट बीट ऑफ द बेबी स्टॉप और व्हाट ऑल प्रॉब्लम्स टू द बेबी वुड कम वी विल कवर एवरीथिंग इन दिस वीडियो रिगार्डिंग टू द एंटेंगलमेंट ऑफ द अम्बिकल कॉर्ड टू द बेबीज नेक When the baby starts moving inside the womb in almost like fifth to sixth month of the pregnancy, the movements are quite slow. But as the pregnancy progress and the baby starts gaining weight, the baby starts becoming strong. These movements get increased, and as the baby is moving inside the womb, there are a lot of chances that this umbilical cord can get twisted to the neck of the baby, and this problem is known as nuchal cord. So there could be chances that the cord is twisted in a very very tight manner and can suppress the supply of oxygen nutrient. to the baby and definitely the situation will come when the baby will feel lack of oxygen and lack of food and it could bring lots of problem to the baby but this doesn't happen normally the reason is due to the presence of wartons jelly that is a gelatinous substance which is present within the umbilical cord which will not allow the umbilical cord to get twisted in a very tight manner so though the umbilical cord can get entangled to the baby's neck but the intensity of tightness is never never high now there could be the chances of the deficiency of this wartons jelly and at that time the nuchal cord problem can be dangerous or if there are more than two babies inside the womb who are sharing the same amniotic sac then the problem is also bigger or if there is only one baby inside the womb but the amniotic fluid is higher again the problem is prominent so in these cases like if you are having multiple pregnancy or you are having more amniotic fluid that is known as polyhydramnios problem or the wartons jelly proportion is not appropriate in the umbilical cord this problem can come whenever this problem will be coming you will feel the reduced movement of the baby so whenever you are feeling that the baby has stopped giving you movements for some long time you should consult your gynecologist in the ultrasound it may be come out the real reason for the nuchal cord or any other problem however the percentage of this problem is very less and if this problem of entangled umbilical cord or the nuchal cord is seen in the ultrasound then the probability of c section that is a cesarean increases because in this case if the normal delivery is carried out then there is more chances that this nuchal cord will tighten up and it will somehow completely turn off the supply of oxygen to the baby which will be a very difficult position for the survival of the baby inside the womb or at the time of delivery but as said the chances of nuchal cord or the entanglement of the umbilical cord are very slim but when so ever you are feeling these changes that suddenly the heartbeat is not coming for some long duration and you have tried out all the methods that we usually give to provoke the baby to give you the movements if all are failing then you should consult your gynecologist if you want to understand what all things you should do when the baby has stopped giving you movements the link is flashing above on the i button you should see that video which will provide you good amount of information on how to provoke the baby to give you movements that's all in this video about the entanglement of the umbilical cord to the baby's neck if you like this video do show me the gesture by pressing the like button if you are landing up to the channel first time consider subscribing push the notification bell and select all to never miss any updates from health tricks and tips in english we'll catch up in another video on pregnancy till then peace out stay happy stay healthy